now making his way over to the blue corner, representing the Kingdom of Bahrain, Ramazan Gittinov. And his opponent in the red corner, representing England, Teddy Stringer. And over at cage number three, this fight ends in the second round by a TKO declaring your winner out of the blue corner, representing the RMMAU, Yusuf Magomedo. Next up, world of weights move into the cage. 77.1 kilograms or 170 pounds. Ramazan Gitanov from Bahrain in the blue corner. His opponent, Teddy Stringer from England in the red. And Gitanov donning the gold colors, signifying he is a champion. Of a reigning world champ, returning to the RMF 2021 World Championships, looking to add more gold to the cabinet. <laughs> Measured approach here from Teddy. Nice jab from Gitinov. Leg kick from Teddy, beautiful work. And he's got to be patient here and try and force the opportunities to present themselves but not rush them. Gets to know of one of the many Russian born fighters competing under the flag of Bahrain. Kitanov was the first winner from 2019 World Championships to enter the cage. Teddy looking for the leg lock here. This is what he's going to do, throw up unorthodox techniques to try and finish. The leg locks are one of those techniques you can use. The pain and the damage goes on quick with the leg locks. As of course he has to avoid using heel hooks. And getting off training and living in Bahrain, competing under the Bahrainian flag. Bahrain, one of the top countries to ever grace the cages of the IMF.
The Bahrain bringing a 27 strong team to Abu Dhabi to compete. Team Bahrain would look to get back to the first place on the official rankings. Prospects of big victories on the horizon. One of their prospects from Bahrain in the cage currently, Ramazan Gitanov in the gold and Teddy Stringer in the red. Clinical striking here from Gitanov. One two from Gitanov and a jab bloodying up the nose of Teddy Stringer from England. Body shot from Teddy. Gitanov beating Teddy to the punch here with the jab. Gitanov with a 16 2 and 0. Oh. Recorded amateur. His last loss in the IMF back in 2017. So he's been on a winning streak in the years leading up to this competition. Nice boxing and teep here from Gitanov. Pouring the pressure on, but it's calm and collected and it's measurable as well. There's a method to his strikes. Some blood on the face here of uh, Teddy Stringer. Absorbing lots of damage from that jab. The left jab of Gitanov. Nice uppercut. Beautiful knee. He's got to be careful about going to the head. Show of respect there from the knee. Went a little bit high. Caught on the guard, but great show of sportsmanship from Gitinov. Oh, Teddy's eating those punches and the jab again in the separation as he pulls his hands down. Getting off so precise with that jab. It doesn't give Stringer any chance to breathe here. There's the level change. Double leg turns the corner. Beautiful work. Full guard overhook now for Teddy. We get set for round two. Ramazan Gitanov from Bahrain in the blue corner. Teddy Stringer from England in the red. Bahrain's Ramazan Gitanov has slowly made himself a top contender at World Weight Division, having won the 2019 IMF World Championships and the 2022, excuse me, 2020 Oceania Open opening. Took him some time to find his feet, however, after early career losses in 2017. But since then, he's been on an unbeaten streak, which saw him win the Asian, European and world titles in 2019. 
Gitinov's corner were calling for him to level change to set up the strikes. Level change come up with the, the overhand right. Level change come up with the uppercut. He's finding the uppercut's close range. Body kick from Gitinov. Teddy's doing a great job of holding his own though against a multiple time world champion. He's absorbed some damage to the face here. But he's not been in any dire trouble as he shoots for a takedown, but gets turned. Now looking for the leg lock, but he's got to be careful about the ground and pound. Nice turning back kick from Teddy. This is what he's got to use. He's got to use fakes and fangs and unorthodox techniques to try and catch Gitanov out. He can't play the technical game. He can't stand in front of Gitanov. He also has to be careful about the level changes. He's got to make sure that he, he draws those legs away after he starts striking. If he's going to kick, he's got to bring those legs back. Body shot from Gitanov. Technical boxing from Stringer as he skips back. To try and hide that jab. Nice left hook on the break. Jab from Stringer. Nice combinations. Body shot from Gitanov. Oh, slip. Left hand. Inside leg kick for Stringer. Teddy's looking good against a multiple world champion and a favorite to win the competition. Gitanov now driving Stringer back to the cage. And over on cage one, your winner by the second round. Hands and arm choke represented our review in the blue corner, Vladimir Petrenko. Stay tuned for our official decision. Who will walk forward, Gitanov or Stringer? Find out momentarily as the judges' scorecards are consolidated as we hand it over to our MC, Ricky Wright. And over on cage two, your winner by unanimous decision in the blue corner from the Kingdom of Bahrain, Ramazan Gitanov. 